Hey guys, I'm Trent. I'm Michael. In this video, we're gonna show you how to create a home and a set home command with script. Okay, so now that we've learned a few tricks with script, we want to create a like per player home system. That way I, as a player on my server, can type set home, and then you as your player can do set home, and we can each have our own homes. So it's like when you sleep in bed in survival and you can set your own spawn that way. Exactly, exactly like that, only with a command. Very cool, I'm gonna stop you real quick, because if you don't know anything about script, you're gonna wanna head to the beginning of this script playlist, get yourself caught up, because this is a little bit more advanced. You gotta know the basics first. Yes, you do. So we already have script installed. I'm gonna go and show you guys. Script, no other add-ons. And then we're gonna go over to the file manager. We're gonna go to our script folder inside here. And then we can see that we've already deleted all the default scripts. We just have our tutorial.sk. We're gonna clear this out from the previous tutorial. Um, or actually, sorry, let me try that again. Um, one second. Uh, sorry, Aaron. Uh, yeah, no, that's my bad. I forgot I didn't wanna clear that out. Um, Okay, so we've cleared out all the default tutorials and we already have our tutorial.sk from our last one. And so this one was a set spawn command. Mm -hmm. um, so we're gonna adapt this script and turn it into the set home. So it's oh, very, okay. very similar actually. Instead of having a server spawn, we're gonna have a per player spawn basically. So I am gonna change the commands to just set home. And I'm, I'm, I'm gonna remove the permission from it because I want everybody to be able to do it. Yeah, only the OP should set the spawn, but the whole point of this is that every player should be allowed to set their own home. Yes, exactly. And then, oh, I almost forgot. I just want to do the editing over in my notepad just in case I lose any progress. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna pull that over there before something happens. Um, okay, so now we want to do it. We're gonna change this variable to home. We're gonna change that to home. Mm -hmm. So set home two, and then we're gonna change all of these real quick. And th this isn't it. Teleporting to home. No, we're teleporting to home. Yes, exactly. So there's a little bit more. So the, the tricky thing here is we wanna make sure that the, right now it would just be one home. And if I type s s set home, we would all have the same home. Yeah, essentially you've just changed spawn to home. Exactly. But we need everybody to be able to set their own home. Exactly, so we're gonna do something sneaky. So we are going to add a period here, and then we're gonna add some player specific stuff. So that way it'll be home dot and then the UUID of the player. Oh, UUID. So you do, yeah, and we like script so great, we just literally type UUID is that of player. Unique user ID. Exactly. And so what that means is that's tied to their Mojang account. So that way if somebody like changes their username or something like that, they still have the same home. Um, so like it's just a good habit of using UUIDs if you're storing any player information. Uh -huh. Um, okay, and then we want to do the same thing down here. Now we're just going to change all of this and we're going to do UUID of player. We're going to add that back at the end. So then like this is replacing a lot of things. So this is set home to and then within this right here, it's the home of the player. It will return the location like the coordinates again mm -hmm. and then it will send that back to the player. Okay, and then we're gonna go down here. And if somebody types slash home, we wanna make sure that they just go to their home. So we're gonna go back here, and we're gonna do UID of player. And there it is. And that should be it. So we are setting the home to their uh, to just their specific player, and then we're gonna teleport it to, or teleport them back to it. Yeah, so the big change here is the dot UUID of player. Exactly, that, that's like really the only difference between slash spawn and slash home. Mm -hmm. But that's what makes it unique to each player. Exactly, so we're gonna head back into the file manager, paste it in, and then click save. We're good to go, we're gonna head in game, and we are gonna do slash SK reload tutorial. Whoops, I missed a few keys. Uh -huh. Tutorial, tutorial. There we go. That's tough. <laughs> That's fun. And then we've got, yeah, we, we, we've got our thing here. So now I'm gonna do, it's, what's, uh, there we go. It's, it's snowing at night. So I'm gonna set my home to right here. Great. So I'm just gonna do set home. Set home to that. Okay, mm -hmm. cool, cool. And then just like with the spawn one, Yep, I'm gonna go over here, I'm gonna type slash home, and cool, cool. So it teleported me to that, but we wanna make sure that if somebody else has set home, that they don't also get teleported to that same location. But of course. Yes. Okay, so now we just wanna make sure that this works for multiple people. So I believe we, oh! That's me! Hello. Hi! Hello. And then and then I, I go back and I'm like, hi, oh yes, hello. Oh, wow. Uh, so if I type slash home- I uh, lost control of my body. <laughs> Oh no, if I type slash home on Michael's account, it tells me that I'm teleporting to home, but it doesn't actually teleport me anywhere. Because we never defined where home is. Yes, exactly. So we might want to do something later on in a different video where we show like, if the variable's not mm -hmm. set, then don't even send them a the message. I'm gonna hop in here. Yeah, there we go. 
and then and then okay, and then we're gonna set home. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then I'm gonna fly back down here. Yep. Boom, boom, boom. I and just needed to make sure that my home had a nice view. Yeah. And, oh no, totally, totally. So slash home. Yep. Very, very good view. And if I head back over here again, we can see if I do slash home here, it brings me down here to my home. And, and now, Michael's still up there. Perfect. So everybody's got their own home now. Exactly. Exactly. And that's how you build a home and set home command in script.